Hey guys, welcome back to Life is Strange 2. Um, last episode, also I'm still sick by the way, we had to escape from a hospital and deal with some racist dickheads, so, you know, just a regular Saturday evening, you know. Jeez. Yeah, I just fucking recorded that one, or just, yeah, literally just now, so now I just have to fucking deal with, like, mentally processing everything that just happened. As does Sean, of course, but... Jeez. I love the shirt. The shirt exception. Sneak. Oh, I love how they- sorry, this is gonna sound kinda gross, but I love how they draw the sweat. Or at least because, like, how it shines on him. Like, it makes it look fairly realistic. Oh, we just have to fucking okay. walk, okay. Still a few hours away from me. <clears throat> we need to ditch the car. Almost there. Okay. Anything else? We have the jacket. Oh. It's broken, but we got it at least. Okay, let's see. Journal. Flores. Oh yeah, the extra papers. Flores tr tried to frame me again. Can't blame. Oh, wait. What's that say? Frame me again. Can't blame her for trying. Oh, tw 2017. Okay. I didn't know this grand officer. Wait. I had to knock the guard officer out so I could escape. I hated when he called me cop killer, but I had to do it to save my ass. Fuck. Go on, Sean. Like, they don't know enough. They don't have enough of against you already. Not so fit for the trip. Hey, thanks for killing me. Have no cash or nothing. She's by so many ghosts. We had cash before, right? Oh, no, wait. We had to buy the fucking thing for Daniel. Reach Nevada. Find Daniel. So hard to drive. Fucking miracle I haven't been in a wreck yet. Gotta pull over soon so I can rest. Driving in the dark with the one eye is the absolute worst. Feel a lot safer working on the edge of the cliff on the moon this night. Ra let racist dickheads immediately at me so they wouldn't beat the shell me. Hurts, but I don't care. My only priority is to find Nino. No biggie, ego. We're gas, gotta walk. Well, I mean, that's fair, because at least I can finally fucking ditch it. You do want to, okay, at this point, though, you would want to ditch it, like, elsewhere. Like, far out that way. So that way they wouldn't be like, oh, he's just gonna keep going along the road. Shit. I oh, wait, break. fuck, I shouldn't run. Might be some shade at the next billboard. <clears throat> oh, this is gonna take a while, probably. I don't want to fucking jog the whole time. My voice is just done. Ugh. I hate fucking hate having fun with a passion. Do we have anything else? No. I'm gonna drive. Two pair casino. <clears throat> Where are the cars? Because I hear like Cars are moving, but I don't see any like along the highway here. Not highway, but just country road. Okay. Spaghetti? <laughs> Poker, blackjack, and spaghetti. One interesting trio right there. Next billboard. <clears throat> and then I can rest a little. Right? Yes. Okay, this one. Shit. I thought he was talking about the next one. I was just like, oh. Jeez. Oh, man. My feet are killing me. It feels like hiking in hell. Drink water first. Shit. Keep hydrated. My throat feels like sand. Oh. 
again, they draw the perspiration so good, honestly. Or not really draw as much as model it. Never drew a desert before. Huh. It's so empty and quiet. Kind of nice in some ways. Peaceful, at least. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. Yeah. It's definitely a really good distraction, at least. So that's good. Little bird. Oh fuck, is there just gonna be like a snake that comes along and bites my ass? Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. This place is so empty. <laughs> At least I won't mess up perspective for once. <laughs> that's true. That's optimistic. I guess that's an okay agree. But I can keep going. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. Yeah. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. I guess I could spice things up a bit. <laughs> Make the whole thing funnier. Draw hell. <laughs> That's a good way to find, I, I guess. Try adding details. Focus a bit more. Huh. Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. Oh, that's actually really yeah. cool. Different creatures. My eye always starts hurting when I focus for too long. Ooh. Oh, that's actually that's really bizarre, honestly. But that's kind of cool in a weird way. Which is like how that actually affects you. Okay. Yeah, we can get up now. Alright, uh, keep on the road. On the road again. Alright. Uh. Daniel I better be okay. Hmm. Feels like I haven't seen him in years. I hope we can work out everything that's happened. It's yeah. <laughs> you can wait to get out on your own. Yeah. Now you are. Yeah. Ooh! It sucks. Oh, wolf? Coyote? Okay. Yeah, I was just gonna say, I'm... I mean, much less I've been hitchhiking, but I haven't really been hiking in general either, which I, I kind of want to change that this next this next year, honestly. Don't worry about your feet. Just pace yourself. True. True. Yeah, I, I do want to change it, like, switch up a little bit. Maybe a little bit of camping. Oh, shit. Hope I'm not running into a trap or something. That would suck ass. Well, I mean, again, they could literally just go get Daniel oh, shit, then. there's a truck coming. I mean, I'm not hitchhiking, so why should he give Whoa. a fuck? Is he honking at me? He's topping. Oh, shit. Okay, uh, be cool. Just see what he wants. I mean, I don't have the hot wired car, so he can't be that bad. Like, I'm not on his fucking property, so. Alright. Truckers can't be cops. Right? I don't think so. That generally doesn't happen. <laughs> Oh, is he really? Oh, does he just want to pick me up? Okay. I'll be quick. Oh, shit. Okay. Here you go. Give him some time to actually rest. Just. Get ready to run. If he's a freak. Please be a friend. Oh, fuck. Why is this bush so hard to pass? Alright, who do we got? Okay. Let's see. Hey, need a lift? It's too damn hot to be walking. I might as well at this point, like... Oh, he's gonna be fucking weird, isn't he? 
uh, don't get in cars with strangers, but like, we do need to get there as quickly as possible. And this might throw people off and be like, oh, if you just walk from this distance, then they'd be able to figure out we're here. Plus, I'm just also yeah. intrigued. Thanks. Hold up. It's kind of weird that he, like, stopped for us, though. But, I don't know. Jesus will save you. Nice. Okay. Simple livings. American flag. Okay. There's a daughter. I think. Choco Crisp, of course. I'm just like, why would he intentionally stop unless we were like trying to hitchhike? Jeez. What the hell happened to you? Got beat up. I ran into a couple of assholes. Beat me up for no reason. Uh, I see. Happens a lot around here. Hands on. You there? Alright? Yeah, what's up? GPS tells me you parked in the middle of nowhere. Why the fuck does that matter? Wanted to know what happened. I uh I had to make a shit stop. <laughs> Over. <laughs> Too much information, but ten four. <laughs> I mean that fucking two. works. You owe me a beer for that. Over and out. Good save. Don't freak out. So his name's I, Anton? I wouldn't have picked you up if I cared about that hitchhiking law. There's a hitchhiking law? Cool. So, you hungry or what? <laughs> you look hungry. <laughs> um. No. Nah. Oh. No, thanks. I'm cool. <laughs> You're lost, son. I was sorry. I just I'm gonna be I'm gonna keep my guard up for now. <laughs> Cause like we could probably get some sustenance when we get there. Mm. Haven Point. You've heard of it? Oh yeah. Straight ahead, about an hour. Okay. Pretty solid. Doesn't seem too mean. He could be a little weird, but like, sign he he doesn't have anything too overt in his car that just you like. Want. You don't have to stay awake to be nice. Hey, don't worry, kid. I'm not a fucking weirdo. I mean, just a. Okay, if the game's gonna do it. Wait, why are you emphasizing boring trucker? That's that's a little sus. Yeah, I'm just like, if the game makes me pass out, then that's not on me. There's another fucking sign of that. Wait, why did it say 22 miles ahead? Have we been driving for longer than that? Like, <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> if we go through another dream sequence, that's how we know we're fucked. Oh! Last up. Damn. Even point. Thank you so much. You just be careful out here. These people are kind of weird. Really? Okay. 10-4, good buddy. Okay. So, he was good. Was suspicious. Kept my guard up. You know, it worked out. We're good. Okay. Oh, right at the fucking church. 
Life is a gamble, bet on the Lord. What? Okay, as a Christian, that sign kind of fucking offends me. Because I'm just like, it's not fucking about that, Jesus. Okay. No, we're taking we're taking a pause to look at this shit right here. For sure. Claire wouldn't have been gambling. For real, for real. Sean knows what's up. Yeah. I don't know if I want to go straight through the church. That might be where Jacob is, but who knows. So glad this guy picked me up. I was stupid to worry about him. Hmm. I just don't know what the repercussions of that are going to be. Do I want to approach this? Okay. Let's see. What's going on? You okay now? Is it gone? I... What? I think. Good. Scoot back inside now. Okay, Dad. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't fucking laugh at a bald spot, but that, that was kind of funny. So, no, that wasn't funny. I, no, I'm sorry. Is everything alright? Yeah, yeah. Uh, don't worry. You here for the service? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I I am. But it's my first time. Don't be shy. Everybody's welcome here. Okay. No matter who you are or where you're from. Okay. In his eyes. We are all equal. Plus, we have a Why? spread after the service. So Why do you need to emphasize you that? Okay. Wait, spread? Uh, like. Thanks. Like food? Don't thank me. That's pretty solid. I'm just a vessel for our reverend. Thank her. <laughs> okay, that's like you're here to woman pastor. It's pretty progressive. Right? Uh, what miracle? <laughs> you haven't heard of him? Then I won't spoil it for you. Oh. He'll be here any minute now. Just oh. come inside and see for yourself. Uh oh. Praise the he? Lord. I wonder what's gonna happen. Okay. That poor little girl. Yeah, I wonder what the fuck was up with that. Real bad. Oh, she's just sick. Okay. Her father was nice. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> I do want to fucking talk about the. Oh, we're just we're all equal here, no matter where you're from or who you are. I'm just like. Maybe people won't judge me here. That felt a little sus to me in some ways not like in the way that he's like being racist but like he's having like some implicit biased thoughts kind of like where he's just like he just cut which again like a lot of people i'm guessing in the area fucking treat sean like a certain way so i guess he, he could be coming from that point of like oh well we won't treat you like that here or something like that it just felt like it kind of rubbed me the wrong way i wonder how many people come and go through this place Are I gonna sing some actual, like, hymns or anything? Should we just go in? Let's probably go through the parking lot, honestly. Ooh, license plate. Wow. Must be a pretty good church to drive all this way. Oh, yeah, from Utah. Nice. Not much different than my hipster stickers. People tend to showcase what they love. Yeah. That's actually, that's really nice of them to actually say, not just be like, oh, fuck, fuck you, that's so cringy. <laughs> I'm just like, where are the Jesus fish, like, stickers, bumper stickers? Like, the, that's where the real shit's at, honestly. My eye is itchy again. Oh, fuck. I can't scratch it, though. Oh, that would fucking, that would feel really weird. Hmm. <laughs> That's pretty Must boring ass here. Pl playground, honestly. Huh. Wonder if Daniel made friends. Hopefully. Hopefully Jacob's actually taking good care of him. <laughs> yeah. Very hard. <laughs> yeah. I mean, being chosen is like a wonderful thing, so I can understand that. But like... You don't want to boast. Like, you don't want to really boast, like, in general. Like, oh, feel that cold air. 
I mean, okay, I don't know. It's Is it boasting if you're sharing... Well, it's still technically about you. You're not really talking about God, so it's not really being humble God, or boasting crazy. about God. <laughs> yeah, thank God. <laughs> That's pretty fitting. Should we go through the balcony? Wonder if Claire and Steven would like this place. Do we want to donate? I don't know if I trust this church enough to donate, so... What is impossible for man is possible for God. With that righteous faith comes the salvation of your souls. Huh. Can you cross that invisible bridge to salvation? Do you want your soul to be saved? Standing around for sisters? Daniel. Yes. Oh, yes. You are not like all these sinners out there. Wait. Okay, I not mm, the Lord for a second. Trying to be like, oh, we're so much better than the people out there is like I don't like that. Spoke to me and told me that I was doing right. And to reward our great faith, the Lord sent me the ultimate gift. An angel. <laughs> yeah, the one fucking girl. Yes he did! The power of God. The miracle. We have all been praying for, waiting for. Can I get a hallelujah? I mean, normally I would pronounce Do it hallelujah, but. In his power. Do you have faith? <laughs> the king of the one fucking me? girl. Like, I, it, it's not bad voice no, acting. Please. It's just like her voice is so distinct. Welcome our newest member and our latest miracle. Latest miracle. The angel Daniel. Oh, there he is. Wait. Wait, what is his hair? <laughs> Sean's just like, what the fuck is happening? No! They gave him a fucking bowl cut. Saved Daniel so he could do his work. Yes. Honestly, Daniel was brought I fucking hate bull cuts, but somehow it looks alright on him. From the wilderness. Like, there are better looks on him now for Daniel sure, will but the true it's not the worst. He just looks so done with everything, though. Oh. Look at him in his nice church clothes. Oh. Whoa. I'm surprised that everyone's buying this and no one's just like, uh, this is kind of blasphemous. Like, cause this kind of conflicts with the book of Revelation. <laughs> okay, wow. I mean, I know people get emotional, like, and everything. Like, feel that Holy Spirit and everything, but... He doesn't know shit. Our flock keeps growing. I see more and more new faces. But this is only the beginning. You must spread the word. Bear witness to this miracle. Thank you so much for coming. 
and God bless all of you. Amen. Okay, wait, was that the prayer? That did not feel like a prayer. Okay. Oh no, As that's not the bald guy. Said, we do appreciate your kind donations. This helps us keep our church hand to spread the word of God. Oh yeah, there's only a few tickets left for our picnic raffle next Sunday. Don't miss the child and another miracle. Any huh. questions? Please talk to me outside. Bless you for coming today. Yeah, I mean, it's just like at this point, like, what have you even gotten yourself into? Because, like, Daniel was, like, willingly, like, throwing that stuff around. So, who knows? Hi. Oh, uh. Oh, it's the girl. I saw you out in that parking lot earlier. Yep, that was me. I like to be here too. We can see the whole room, and it's where our Reverend Mother teaches us classes. <laughs> On the balcony? Oh. oh. You okay? Need some water? Uh, no, sorry. I'm just kind of sick. Oh, that sucks. Oh, <laughs> that's too bad. Dan, Dan, I mean, not Daniel. Sean, you are so fucking bad at being like sympathetic slash empathetic. But we love you. What happened to your eye? Well, that's a long story. <laughs> that's okay. My name is Sarah Lee. What's yours? Uh, oh, you can tell she's from the South. Oh, oh, her last name is Lee. Okay. I was just like, yes. this kid's from the South. They always got like their names like Anna Lee, like uh, Mary Ann, Mary Jane. You are Daniel's brother? Really? He's always talking about you. Hey, uh... Not too loud. <laughs> yes, I'm Daniel's brother, but I need some help. The Reverend Mother says we always have to help our neighbors. Amen. She got that right at least. All right. Uh, what is this place? What is this place? This is our home, <laughs> our church and community. The Reverend Mother says we are all chosen by God. Who is this reverend? You don't know her? That's I mean, it's pretty husband. obvious. She was... she was blessed by the hand of God when she was my age. <laughs> she can't ever sin. Uh, Lord no, me. that's not how it fucking works. No, 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 no. What is Daniel? I mean, there's a difference from being freed from sin and He's not, like, fucking, like, and sinning again. Right like that. Okay. I like him. He's really kind and funny. Aww. We play together all the time. That's really that's sweet actually that he is being kind of good to hear that. So though. can you take me to Daniel? Oh yes. He's gonna be so happy when he sees you. He missed you so much for his birthday. Oh it no! Be like a late surprise. He already has birthday? Hmm. Daniel, you're the living proof of their faith. And mine. I know you understand. I guess... I mean... Sean? Oh my... Sean! He came back! Oh. I knew it! You've grown up in Anna. Do I look older? What? What happened to your eye? Don't worry. It's okay. Did that happen at the farm? Because of me? I'm so sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. Oh. I'm not gonna say I warned you. Um, wait. Fuck. Um, it's... Forget it. It wasn't your fault. I should have... It's okay. Does it hurt? No. Not as much as your haircut. Oh. <laughs> it's different. I kind of like it. Uh, you know what? Sean, For it being a bowl cut, it doesn't look too bad. 
nothing I could do. I was so scared. I even thought you were dead. <laughs> and the other people okay. were just like, uh, okay. We're together now. Yes. So, are you gonna stay with us now? Huh? I. We still need to go to Puerto Lobos. But. We don't need to. We have a new home now. Look. One step at a time, Din. Give mm -hmm. Sean a chance to process this. I'm sure this is all so overwhelming. Okay, why are you... Way, my name is Lisbeth Fisher. We all prayed for your safe return. Sean, you must be a believer now in our Lord, too. Mm, kind of. Mm. Kind of. Daniel told me you had faith. I believe in what Claire believes. I don't Claire. I don't believe in what she believes. And Reverend, Daniel, to grab the medicine kit, we have to take care of our new guest. This is a place of healing. Aww. Let's do it later. I want to talk to him now. Daniel, now. Oh. Okay, Reverend. Oh, damn. Go, Daniel. Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Well, Sean. Oh. It's a pleasure to meet you. This is a real blessing today. You were away from Daniel for quite a while. I was in a coma. Of course. Mm. I wasn't judging you. So what is your plan, Sean? This is a blessed family, and it would be good for Daniel to have you by his side. You should know that the Lord has big plans for him. I mean, we should just fucking lie. Let's stay here for a while. Stay Maybe here. For I could stay here for a while. Yeah. No. Stay I here and then just fucking just leave in the middle of the night sometime. But small is the gate and narrow the way. Mm. I've heard everything about your journey, Sean. What? And I cannot let a sinner like you into my Bitch, what? Okay, she did like a complete 180 right there. Okay. Community. Not until you make penance. What? Are you serious? I'm did, sorry. Wait, did I just son. miss I'm that? Or did his head son. just fucking just yet, immediately just blip to the right or whatever? Okay. Daniel isn't gonna be your golden cow. Daniel, come on. Why don't we ask him what he wants to do? Do not touch me. Oh, shit. What the fuck? What did you do? Nothing. Enough. You spilled blood. Uh. In the wards. Sean! What happened? She Your fell. Came in here, impure and acting like a criminal. But he can be saved, Daniel. She's right! You showed up, and look what happens. Like all the time. Uh. I will pray for you. And mm. she's trying to manipulate you. Let me lead you. To the one true light that never goes out. I want to be your friend. You're crazy. Let's get out of here, Daniel. I want to stay. Shit. Just go. There's your answer, Sean. We're together again. So we can go, right? Come on. Get off. Whoa. Me. What? Daniel! <coughs> Let me go, asshole! <laughs> Daniel! They're not your family. Stop it. You just need to have faith. We'll be waiting. Daniel. It's okay, Sean. Sean. Daniel. Also, it's so fucking annoying. I was not being fucking like. There you go. Annoying or Satisfied. whatever. Now don't you ever come back. Uh, she said I could. I'll get up. You know what? I'm gonna get up. I'm fucking tired of people. Don't make me do this. You're Wait. not gonna win. I did not do anything, bitch. Daniel! Daniel! You're pissing me off. This is private property. I have a legal right to stop any intruders. Like you. I just... 
And does the Bible give you a legal right to shoot people? My brother. But he doesn't want you. He was brought here. And this is where he's staying. Next time, I will not hesitate to use this. Now get out of here. Daniel, hey! Daniel! Sean? <gasps> Wait. You won't get him back like this. Let's go. I'm just like, I'm I, I, like a middle aged woman. I was like, no way. She better have like a good ass story. Because I mean, I might be willing to like sympathize or empathize, but <laughs> Sean is on a whole other level with that shit, so. Sean, what happened to your eye? Why the hell are you here? How did you find me? Well... Um... I got a letter from... Jacob. He said you were missing. And that Daniel needed help. I believed him. Hmm. So you finally decided to check on it. Ooh. You know, Sean, sooner or later, we're gonna have to talk. <laughs> Where are we even going? I already have a hotel room. You're gonna need to rest. Okay. And clean that dressing. I like her her voice actress, like, she has like a pretty solid tone to her. Let's see, how long have we been going for? Okay. Oh. The shower scene. Mandatory for like every fucking video game, I guess. Or like anime for that matter. Oh, jeez. Okay, it's interesting. Just regular t shirt on now. I mean, to be fair, that tank top was pretty intense. Like, he looked Did like he came back from a war, so. That felt good. Damn. You look bad. <laughs> Gotta change that dressing soon. Probably now. I mean, why are you waiting? Just do it. Karen seems to be on the move quite often. Hmm. Anything else in here? Wait, do we have anything new in the journal? Let's see. Picked up by a trucker not far away. Main point. I was nervous, but the guy was sweet. Faith in humanity is somehow restored. Need to keep that going. Need that to keep going. Okay. Brainwashed by a cult. I'll just stay with them. I fucked up with this reverend. No, <laughs> that's so fucking dumb. What's she doing here? How'd she find us? Not a. Oh, she's gone. Wonder how long Karen has been here. Did she see one of Daniel's? 
miracles. <laughs> so <laughs> that's a fucking weird way to put it. Way too big. I mean, it's literal based on how they've been describing it, but it still sounds kind of fucking funny. Karen's always into low tech. <laughs> I even think it's the one she had back then. <laughs> There's. What? Would that actually? There's no way it'd still be fucking working. I mean, I don't it's know. Long, long Old tech lasts a lot longer than new tech, where it just fucking lags to hell and back. This thing is killing my back. I got bruises on my bruises. <laughs> Alright. Oh, shit. No. Here we go. Wait. Wait, let's see this first. So Karen did check it out. Huh. I wonder if she saw Daniel in action. Yeah, actually, because Daniel wouldn't really recognize her too much, so. Kind of pretty. wonder if she made it. Hmm. No, I'm not going to inspect her bag. Because I, I fucking know this game is going to be like, I can't believe you went through my stuff. I really should finish reading this someday. It's got some cool stories in it. Oh. Fucking... Oh, wait. Oh. Sorry. I still have no game. Might as well. And Good souvenir. Always wins. All sinners is an achievement. Wow. Great. Okay. Let's read the note. Be right back. Oh. <laughs> Popped out for some supplies. For some food in case you want to eat it. New socks and shorts in the bathroom. All yours if they fit. Be a good time to contact Jacob. His number is on the letter he sent. Be right back. Okay. Shit. Hold on. Oh. Jeez. It only took Supermom eight years to give a shit. <laughs> this is Jacob. What are your sons? Oh, so he was the one who got in contact with him. Oh. Oh, so he gave her the P.O. box that he found from Claire. That's actually really cool how they actually got that. Like, and how that kind of wove together. Let's see. Huh. This isn't her tablet. Hope you find your son. Oh. Yay. Technology. Ooh, can we find, um... Prepared. The whole Brody page? Okay. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to fucking read it from here. This is a weird ass website. Just the formatting of it. Okay. See, so kind of like what they're getting into with this chapter, because it's just like. They were being overtly racist, but it seems like they just want to deny people that just don't kind of fit their vision, really. But they just like to preach that, oh, we're so accepting and equal and everything. Okay. Interesting. Reverend Mother doesn't look too humble. Yeah, this this kind of gives me cult energy, honestly. Looks like a Roach Motel. But <laughs> Hot dog buster, man. Nice. It's cheap. I mean, why is it one star then? You'd rate it two stars then. Nice pool, but dusty as fuck. Cool. <clears throat> I feel like it would be like four stars, three stars, two stars was how they would actually rate it. This place is quite remote. <clears throat> Good. At least nobody Not bad. Be looking for me here. Yeah. Yeah, let's get some natural light in here. Ooh. I got a few oh, pfft. I thought draws would fucking draw Let's open practice. the curtains. I mean, that works too. Oh, 
Okay. Just draw now. Don't think about anything else. I don't get this side too. Yeah, that's interesting how like not having the other eye plays a factor and having to get this other to side now. done. I guess that's an okay start. But I can keep going. I can mm. see myself stopping by this motel during a road trip. Huh. Taking a dip with in Daniel. the after a long ride. Going with Cassidy. Oh. These mountains really inspire me. See, I was... I was kind of like, feeling like, ooh... Finn and Sean would be kind of interesting. Who lives here. <laughs> fucking so octopus. Okay. Huge. But I don't know. Oh shit, jeez, that's intense. But um, yeah, after the last chapter, I was like, okay, maybe I I prefer Cassie a lot more actually. Also, it was funny because then I fucking compared the choices and I found out I literally had done everything basically that I could to like get a romance going with Finn but because I said no to the plan I basically locked myself out of it so that's Time really fucking Jacob. funny well, yeah I can do that okay wait the, the phone Karen's all tech. call the okay I even think it's the one she had back then tablet no she came prepared okay Nope. I don't. Okay. Oh. Pff. Well, okay, this phone, I guess. Jacob, it's me, Sean. Probably good to actually hear from a friend, honestly. Yeah. I should have talked to him more last chapter. Damn it. I was just I like, know. oh, I don't really click far. with him as much. Because I thought, like, he was the suspicious one, but he was actually the one who got out of the cult, I'm guessing. Daniel, how's he doing? Unless he's gotten back into the cult. Jacob, wait. Oh shit, they have them under like high surveillance then. Damn. He couldn't really talk. Oh, this only is so option is out. to wait for Karen. I don't really want to inspect it. Yeah, it's giving me the option too when I could just wait. I'm so drained. So I'm not gonna do it. Just Unless the game is just gonna be like, oh, so you weren't interested you to hear like how I've been doing or something like that. Like it's just like Sean just responds like, I don't care about your life. So that's why I didn't inspect the bag. <laughs> hey, sorry it took so long. The fucking store was packed. <laughs> she curses as much as Sean. So, how are you feeling? Nothing broken. Walter boys don't fight fair. Yeah. Huh. I'm okay. Double cheese, no onion. Ooh. That'll do. <laughs> She's just like, fuck it, I'm hungry. I'll take it. Great, now I'm fucking hungry too. <laughs> it's like what? Fucking 12.20. If I... I could order fucking DoorDash. That's always the option, I guess. Got you some antibacteria stuff. For your eye. Huh. Hey, don't wolf that down. Or at least take a breath. <laughs> like you care. Sean. I do. <sighs> Come on, Karen. Don't act all hurt. It's too late. Where were you when I broke my leg when I was 13? Not with me. 
when Daniel got a bad flu a couple of years ago, you didn't sleep next to him every night. Ooh. Where were you? Where were you? Fair enough. So let's talk, because we do have to get your brother out of a cult. <laughs> yeah, let's fucking call it as it is. Because like her or not, she's your ally, so... <laughs> got some help, yeah. We had a lot of people help us, so... And got some help along the way. Total strangers. Yeah, Brody. Good. How did you go to Beaver Creek? Well, and everyone else in the weed farm. You're right. So tell me what you want from me, Sean. Nothing, Karen. I mean, what do you want from me? A fucking hug? Hey, I just want you to know what I did. And why. If you care. So, ask me anything. Okay. I mean, just fucking cut straight to the chase as well. Right. As well. Why did you bail on us? I wasn't meant to be a wife or a mother. I thought I was supposed to. I tried to pretend for many years. But I wasn't happy. And the urge to leave just became unbearable. I had no other choice. Are you serious? You chose this life. You fell in love. You made your own choices. Right? Making your own choices doesn't mean you can never fool yourself, Sean. After I had Daniel, you were about eight, and Esteban's garage was getting busy. There was so much going on around me, and somehow I just felt that my own life was just slipping away. I felt like an empty shell. Sean, it was the hardest decision I ever made. Well, t yeah, no shit. Should have been. Did Dad know about all of this? I was honest with your father. We did family therapy, but it wasn't about him. It was me. <laughs> oh shit, okay. Yeah. I'm not gonna say- eh, let's not like fucking just curse her out or whatever. He was heartbroken for months after you left. Years. I was too. I was in love with your father. He was the best person I ever met. But just not enough for you. Something was missing from the equation, yeah. I was. Okay, let's see. What so are you what doing exactly here are now? Doing in Nevada? Nevada? No, I'm uh, way out in Arizona. Sean, I told you. Your friend uh, Jacob wrote my P.O. box and said Daniel was in trouble. That's yeah. it. Arizona. Arizona? Holy shit. It's just lizards and rocks. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Found something there. And fucking Sheba. New York didn't really do me good, so... Yeah. Okay. I think I've heard enough. I didn't have a choice, Sean. We only have one life. And I didn't want mine to be spent in regrets. For years. I fooled myself, thinking I'd find satisfaction into what society expected me to be, and that was my mistake. I hope someday you can understand that. Hmm. But I never stopped caring about you. For what it's worth, I am sorry for hurting you and Daniel and Esteban. Okay, on one hand, I just want to be like, I forgive you, like, whatever, it's all in the past, but like, I also want to really empathize with Sean here, because like, this is a lot for him as well, so. I mean, might as well. I know you are, Karen. It still doesn't change the way I feel. Okay, that's, that's a good statement then. I know I can't change the past, Sean. I don't think you would. I need some air. 
Interesting. Okay. I mean, I'm not gonna draw again. I already did that, so. Fuck you. I mean, I get you wanted to leave and stuff, okay? But why would you ghost us like that? Not even a fucking birthday card. I just... I yeah. thought if I vanished, you would all move on. But I wanted to contact you guys so many times. That that does make sense. At least it wasn't like, oh, I didn't feel like I wanted to, you know. Like, it felt like more like she was doing that for them. But you wanted a clean break from us. I didn't want to be a part-time, pissed-off mother. Not fair to any of you. I left when Daniel was still very young, so he wouldn't remember me. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I wasn't that lucky. Oh, Sean. I know. Do you want to tell me how you felt then? Or now? I felt guilty that we weren't enough for you. No. I hope I can make it up to you, Daniel. I mean, not make it up, but... Oh, someday, okay. Stop getting his ass out of that church. Cult. <laughs> Whatever. So... What did you do when you left? Where did you go? I pursued some dreams. And failed. <laughs> Learned the lessons. I guess all this time I tried to find out what really matters to Which me. Which doesn't involve a husband and two kids. It does to a lot of people. And I totally respect that. Just not to me. I wasn't good at making plans. Which is what most of modern life is about, right? School, job, yeah. marriage. Ask my mom and dad. <laughs> they wanted me to follow their rules. Their faith. But I wanted to find my own way, with no security blanket. I mean, and Sean can relate to that on a personal level, at least. Norms. It's just all about security, after all. But it all just looked like a sweet golden jail to me. I tried to escape that. Worth it? Yeah. Hope it was worth it. It was. For now, I've found my place in the world, with like-minded people. I'm at peace with my fuck-ups and my decisions. How do you make peace with bailing on your parents, your husband, and your kids? I know, that's hard to understand. But I think people should know who they are. Not fake it for anybody. I mean, that's, that's also very true in the sense of, like, why people bail out of marriages, like, say, I mean, not even just, like, talking about, like, her situation, but also when, like, someone's, like, so deep in the closet and they just don't want to say, like, they're gay because they've just been at it for so long and stuff like that. So, did you ever actually miss us? Or dad? Of course, Sean. I do miss your father. Ugh. He has such a big heart. He could brighten up a rainy day. That was like his superpower. But above all, I miss watching you grow up. See how you saw the world. 
I miss sharing these moments with you, Sean. We used to do so much stuff. Like when you taught me to ride because Dad sucked. <laughs> or when we went camping near Vancouver. Just me and you. You always loved night skies. I did stargaze a lot when I was in California. Trust me, the further south you go, the better it gets. Mm. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> you sound so... careless. It's like you can't even realize how much pain you've caused. I do care. That's why I'm here. To help you and your brother. If I didn't step up to help him now, I couldn't live with myself. Huh. Huh. <laughs> I've got that in common, at least. Hey, um... Mind if I blow the smoke? Sure. Still got a few left. Nice, nice. Sharing a nice smoke with the mom. Kinda interesting that it's the mom that smokes. Cause like, it's it's definitely nice to actually see like, a switch up of like, gender norms and everything like that. I mean, especially just like in society where it's just like, media portrays the dad is like the bailout one, or the bail, the one that bails, I mean. And the mom, like the single mom just having to tough it out. I remember he would smoke sometimes. Oh. Ago. We didn't fight much, but when we did, I would go out on the porch and light up so I could calm down. Esteban would come over and ask for a drag. Hmm. And I would just look up at the sky and watch the stars, or the planes. I do miss that. I used to do the same with my best friend, Mike. I don't know, she probably was more than the best friend since she was basically family at that point. Just letting time go. That's when you know someone is good to you. And you can just sit together, shut the hell up, and watch the universe do its own thing. Because honestly, probably Lila <laughs> is like really the one that Sean likes. I mean, he probably really does like Jen, but like knowing Sean, he probably also has repressed, like, or suppressed repressed feelings about like um actually liking lila just being like no i don't want to like ruin the friendship or anything like that we should go back inside i gotta change this dressing okay let's go I know I can't change the past. Or what I did. But this is about helping your brother. I gotta you say, I am... Me this one time. I'm glad she's making it about them and not about herself. I know. Because she's just explained her situation, been very upfront, but and yes. very honest. We have to be a team to rescue Daniel. We can do it. Okay. Huh. We need to get in touch with this Jacob. <laughs> this God, Jacob. a lot more than us about the church. Well, I called him when you were out. Mm. We can meet with him tomorrow. Okay, good. I also got these, just in case. Ooh, walkie-talkies? Okay. Better take care of the eye. So, do you need any help with that? Ah, fuck it. Yes. How's that? So, like, so I could lash I out and be like emotional about it, here. but when who knows? Gotcha.
better be careful. Oh, I don't like the sounds. Can I skip this? No, come on. It's interesting though, like having to compare like um what she looks like to like her or like Dan or to, or to like him or like Daniel. <laughs> How do I look? Great. <laughs> Thank you, Karen. Big day tomorrow. So we should get some rest. Okay. Yeah. I'm ready to get Daniel. All right, and that is where we have to leave things off. I'm sorry to leave things off on a cliffhanger. Also, jeez, like my nose is making it so doing this outro is gonna be the worst fucking thing ever. So I apologize in advance. But yeah, this is a this is really solid. I'm really liking this so far. I'm really liking the redemption arc for the mother. It's pretty solid. Um. I don't know what else to say, so um, I'll fucking end off the episode here fucking blow my nose 500 times. Alright guys, bye!